So, Rob Kardashian takes to the stand. I did not expect this man to be even taking to the stand, to be honest with you, but he has, he's absolutely dragged Black China guys, and it just simply just does not look good for her. Hey guys, it's Marab Muradi. Hopefully you guys are all doing well today. Back at it again, it is daily and consistent content. And let's get straight into this video, guys. Subscribe to the channel and let's get into this video. So Rob Kardashian, guys, takes to the stand. Takes to the stand, guys. Ah, Rob Kardashian, according to people at the trial today, was seen as to be very nervous as he entered the courtroom and often mopped sweat from his head with a rag as he spoke about his alleged violent relationship with China. In court today, Rob said that he couldn't remember when he began pursuing China but via Instagram. He said that he was single then and that he had just graduated from college at that point. Asked about his engagement to China, he told the court they got engaged but it was all for show and not for real love. In court today, Rob said that his family planned a baby shower for him in China but she got upset and never attended, according to this reporter at the trial. Ultimately, the shower was cancelled and they ended up having one just with their friends. Rob told the court he regrets this as his family was just trying to be happy and make her happy as well. In court, Rob was asked whether China had ever disrespected... Um, the Kardashians, and he responded, there were a hundred different times she was disrespectful towards my family. She tried to threaten my little sister, Kylie. China was seen smirking um, whilst Rob was, you know, doing his testimony. Now, that is interesting as well. Um, he also goes on to say that, you know, there were times where she was quite violent with him. Um, it wasn't real love. It was, um, it, um, I had a baby with this girl. Um, I had a, you know, gun to my head several times by this woman that is not love um not once not twice guys but several times so they don't force this man into court because you know he definitely wasn't coming it wasn't on his agenda he wasn't meant to testify it was to be the four girls but evidently perhaps they needed him to try and solidify their case or because they, they wanted to strengthen their case i think i think that is just simply the reason for why he was dragged into court guys but i didn't really expect that at all whoo Somebody is saying, why didn't you call the police? People are saying, you know, this is in divorce court. Um, someone said, Black China, go ahead and leave the courtroom for me. You have lost the case. Go ahead and drop the case, ma'am. Um, hate to say this. Um, I hope I don't sound ridiculous, but I believe him, somebody said. Um, someone said, the fruit don't fall far from the tree. Tokyo Tony like, acts like this as well. So they flip-flop. They both need to heal separately and come together and heal. They let the industry eat them up and spit them out and it shows. Someone said, what does this have to do with them getting the TV show cancelled? Interesting. Um, someone said, the family six sticks together at the end of the day. Um, China is her mother's child. So, you know, he really has come through, guys. This is obviously very good for the jury. Very, not, sorry, very good for the Kardashian team, the lawyers, because they wanted to obviously really cripple down this character. And he is obviously part of the show, part of it being renewed, Rob and China. It's not just China's show, it's Rob's show as well. And if he, Rob himself, is coming out from coming out from the horse's mouth saying that this is what she's done to me continuously, meticulously, a hundred times, disrespectful, it wasn't a good relationship, I didn't feel comfortable with her at all, I regret X, Y, Z, then, you know, they're going to say that this is the reason why the second season didn't go through, regardless of it being green or whatever, because it just was not conducive or productive to their relationship, to their mental health. The family was right for Rob. They wanted to stop everything and get her out of the picture because she was a bad influence this is their argument and rob being understand you know being questioned coming through with this i didn't expect any of that i didn't expect him to be coming even showing his face but here he is guys coming to this and china seems to be amused by his testimony smirking at his testimony is she you know looking at him because she knows that he's lying or the fact that you know she just doesn't care about the situation and knows that it's going to be a sinking ship for her because i do think that potentially it could go down that route because of rob's damning allegations damning testimony probably the most damning thing and of course he is the most crucial part of this case alongside china it's rob and china's show so you know you know you need both of them to move on to the next season and if rob who's saying xyz it does doesn't look good for China guys we have to remain objective here I personally have always wanted China to win this case but also Rob's Rob's um, verdict coming live from the court guys it's just not looking good for him as well and then on top of that you have Corey a witness you know it could be again these things aren't directly related to um, the show being greenlit the stuff around it but the jury is watching all of this and they are building a character profile of china by seeing these testimonies witness testimonies or whatever you want to call it and it doesn't look like it could be swaying that way Rob was asked this, um, whew, oh my days guys, this is just, it's just not looking good for her guys. It's not looking good for her. Rob has come to really seal the deal here. Hopefully, you know, things can look up for China, but we'll just see. Although this doesn't directly relate to the case, it's adding up guys. It's adding up.
Especially because China's team, Lin Shani, has admitted that they don't have any other witnesses to come to the stand to defend China. They don't have any of that. Whereas, you know, the Kardashians have had two people now, Rob, who's part of the case, and of course, Corey. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Click that button. It is daily and consistent content. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. It's 12.30 in the morning here, and I will catch you guys soon for another update.